Congratulations, class of 2022. You made it. Here's what comes next. It's time for orientation. Here's a brief overview of the schedule. On day one, students can look forward to meeting others in their small groups, learning more about their individual colleges and the different services provided on campus, and what it means to educate the whole student through our Jesuit mission. On day two, see what engaging with a faculty member looks like in a classroom environment and receive your schedule along with one-on-one -on -one academic advising. Parents will attend various informational sessions apart from students in order to prepare for their hawk to leave the nest. In order to benefit from everything that orientation has to offer and for your safety, we ask that students remain on campus for the duration of the program. We have so much to share with you, so please plan to stay for the whole event. But before you start your jets, there are a few things you will need to bring along. A backpack or duffel to pack your things in, your wallet, some form of photo ID, your phone, a phone charger, personal toiletries, including shower supplies if you'd like to do so, a notebook and pen or pencil to take notes at information sessions, a water bottle, shoes you feel comfortable in for long periods of walking and standing, sleepwear, a set of clothes for the following day, and a light jacket. Remember, for your overnight stay, you will be provided with bed sheets, a pillow, and a towel. You will likely be placed with a roommate. Students will be paired up based upon the gender identity that you indicated on your orientation registration. Additionally, here is a list of some things we ask you to leave at home. Tobacco products, alcohol, marijuana, and other drugs, pets, and excess luggage. And now it's time to meet your OAs. Hey, I'm Sarah, and I am going to be your orientation advisor at Summer in Seattle. I'm studying sociology and anthropology, and I'm from Agora Hills, California. I can't wait to meet you.